Welcome to digitalconstructive.com and in this video we're taking a quick look at a few C38 refrigeration license exam questions. Where must the emergency control be installed for a refrigeration room? The correct answer is B, immediately outside the refrigeration room's exit. Metering devices are sized to which system's components BTU rating? The correct answer is C, the evaporator. A contractor is bidding to install a walk-in cooler and finds that the compressor costs $4,600 and the piping is $5.76 per foot for 200 feet of pipe. If this is 40% of the contract, what is the contract's total bid price? The correct answer is D, $14,380. Now these are just a few of the thousands of possible questions that could appear on the C38 license exam. Obviously, you're going to need to know about planning and estimation of refrigeration projects, installing specialty refrigeration systems, the TEF references, uh, California electrical codes, California health and safety codes, California mechanical codes, troubleshooting electrical problems, mathematics, personal and job site safety. These are all things that are going to be referenced on the test. So it's really important that you have the right information that you're looking at and you have seen uh, all of the possible questions that could appear on exam day. Now, 24% of the test covers planning and estimating, 29% covers refrigeration system installation, 24% covers refrigeration system repair, 13% covers refrigeration system maintenance, and 10% covers safety. Now, it's important to remember that the test references thousands of kind of uh, textbook style references. What we've done is we've taken the most important information on the exam. We've created a complete trade study review in a summarized cliff note format. It's a deep dive from A to Z on the refrigeration trade covering exactly what's on the test. It's presented to you in a very clearly written way with examples and descriptions and tons of visual diagrams in plain English. Now this can come in either an ebook or physical study guide. You get tons of online practice tests, online videos, a mathematics course to make sure that you're prepared for those estimating related questions and a complete application preparation uh, and review to ensure that your application is filled out correctly before you send it off to the CSLB. Just wanted to make this video because a lot of you guys were asking about the exam questions. We've got two other videos that you're definitely going to want to check out. One goes a lot deeper into the exam, the law side, what kind of math you can expect, um, what the process looks like where you take the exam, the costs, you're definitely gonna wanna check that out. And then we've got another one that goes into the requirements, filling out your certification of work experience correctly, uh, if you're applying with a criminal record, all the different requirements for a contractor license in California, definitely check out those two videos. And if you're interested in our C38 crash course, you can find that in the links below this video. I hope you found this information helpful. If you have any questions, drop them in the comments below. Uh, be sure to like and subscribe to the video. And uh, this is digitalconstructive.com. And thanks again for watching.